In part two of this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to assign multiple outputs. At the moment, the Fruity Loop song is coming into Samplitude as a stereo mix on track one of the Samplitude mixer. Pressing the M button will mute the input from Fruity Loops. To begin, select the master channel in Fruity Loops and turn off the output by setting it to none. Now select channel 1 and assign that to FL1. Channel 1 is now routed to Samplitude Mixer channel 1. Select channel 2 and choose output FL2. 3 goes to FL3. Select channel 4 and that's going to output FL4. 5 goes to 5. You can see the rerouted tracks all appearing in the Samplitude Mixer. 6 goes to 6. And finally, 7 goes to you guessed it, FL7. I can now control the Fruity Loops tracks using the Samplitude Mixer. So that's the separate Fruity Loops outputs assigned. I'm now going to freeze each track so I can use the WAV files in Samplitude. Press I to open the project options and I'm going to put in the length of the project which is about 130 bars. This will make sure that the tracks will only be frozen for the duration of the project length. Left click on the first track and select track freeze from the menu. I've edited this video to speed up the rendering process, so in reality it will take a bit longer. You can now see that the frozen track is 130 bars in length. Left click on the Fruity Loops plugin to disable it. We now have track 1 rendered as a WAV file. Re enable the Fruity Loops plugin so I can freeze track 2. Left click and select track freeze. That's track 2 Frozen, which is the bass line. Have a listen to that. Down to track 3. Remember to re-enable the plugin and I'm going to select track Freeze again. That's the kick drum rendered as a WAV file. I'll have a listen to that. That's three tracks done. Now select track four and left click track freeze again. Disable the Fruity Loops plugin. I'll solo that track to have a listen. Reposition the cursor. some kind of hi-hat fill. Next is track 5. Re-enable the plugin and select track freeze. I'm sure you've got the idea by now. That's track 5 frozen. I will set it to full screen so we can see better. Have a listen to that bit. Now track 6, left click, track freeze. Disable the plugin and solo that track to have a listen. Sounding good, and last but not least, track 7. Just in case you've forgotten, left click and select track freeze for that track. Oh, 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 oh,
So there you have it. That's how you can convert rewire tracks to audio tracks in Samplitude Music Studio.